So on behalf of Mandy and myself, it's my great pleasure and privilege to welcome you all here today at this amazing venue on such a glorious day to celebrate the marriage of Isaac and Grayson. You ready? Yeah. Hey, you remember when we first met? Okay, I don't remember when we first met, but hey, admitting is a first step. Hey, hey. <laughs> Grayson, I can't say we fell in love at our first sight, or that I was even nearly ready at a year seven formal. <laughs> but I can say with 100% certainty that today I'm marrying my soulmate. Today is one of the most certain and best decisions of my life. <laughs> From crushing hard in year six to now, it has always been you. <laughs> I promise to love you every day, without hesitation, even when you forget birthdays. <laughs> in front of all of our loved ones, I marry my best friend and offer all of my heart to you. I promise you my honesty, blunt and uncontrollable, <laughs> but always with love. I promise you my respect and admiration from your outlook on life to the way you wear high heels better than me. <laughs> I promise you my protection, even when you don't want it <laughs> or need it. I will always be there to arc up and make them wonder whether my bite is worse than my bark. <laughs> I promise to be dependable and supportive always and to appreciate everything you are because you truly make me so incredibly happy. As we begin our life together in front of our friends and closest, I vow to wake up every morning and thank God that he gave me you, my perfect woman. Committing the rest of my life to you is actually pretty easy because without you, the world would be greatly uninspired. Even when the world is dark, my world is bright because my world is you. I promise you me, all that I am, with all of my love, unconditionally. As your wife on this day and every day forward, I love you. I vow to be your steady rock in turbulent times. I vow to always be united with you, as I know we're only as strong as we are united and as weak as we are divided. Grayson, I love you unconditionally and always will. The authority given to me by the government of this land, it's my honour to pronounce you husband and wife, and you may kiss your bride. Grayson, you're looking truly gorgeous today, and I'm sure everyone would agree. Your inner beauty is as stunning as your outer beauty, but beauty is only one of Grayson's many attributes. She is a fiercely loyal, fun-loving, dependable, strong, caring, determined young woman with a cheeky sense of humour and we see that come out a lot when you two are together. <laughs> Isaac, you're a lucky man. Sure. I would like to thank Wendy and Andy for, being, for bringing up this fine young man. He is a credit to you both and to your family. We have seen him mature over the years, um, for the past 11 years. Um, from a shy young buck into a confident, mature, loving, thoughtful and caring young man. His love for Grayson has been unrelenting and they have already forged... A very strong partnership with friendship. As the cornerstone of their relationship, they are just so good together. I've always had that little saying, my precious sort of thing. And they go around saying that all the time and it's all about the ring. And today you guys put the rings on and uh, he found us precious. I'll just uh, leave you with two Kiwi words, actually Māori words. And the first one's kia kaha, which means strength and encouragement. So I just encourage you guys to always encourage each other and strengthen each other. And the other word is araha, and that means love and affection. So just keep your love and your affection going and she'll be right. Congratulations to you, Mr. and Mrs. Stott. Here's to a long and wonderful life together and we love you both dearly. Yeah.